Welcome to the channel, guys. Hi. Gooey Films. In this episode, we have two things going on. My buddy brought his blazer over. We're gonna do a quick walk around of that, but stick around to the end of the video because we are going to Tough Truck and we're gonna check it out in action. recommend this hobby to, to... no because it's a stupid uh, hobby <laughs> <laughs> what got you into this fun hobby been into trucks all my life I'd say from being a 14 15 year old dad started with the old 87 suburban and uh, went from there truck started out as a 95 s10 uh, I, I, when I bought it it was just a stock one um, I put on half ton axles with 350 in it with 35 inch boggers Wheeled it for six six years on the road and on trails. And then after that, it's just started progressing from there. Got hooked up with a bunch of diff different buddies and uh, started getting more into rock crawling and stuff like that. And then it progressed into this. How long did it take you to build it? This version, two and a half years in the shop. It's been in the shop for two and a half years under the knife. How long do you work on your day job all week? 10. 10 hours a day, and then come into the shop for three or four hours a night, plug away at it. The suspension on it is uh, what they call double triangulated four link, front and rear. Then we went with uh, EMF, uh, the biggest EMF joints we could find. We have 16 inch ORI shocks, so we've got a fair bit of travel on it. 05 Super Duty front end, and what, that we cut up and swapped over to a passenger side drop. Work with the uh, Chevy uh, transfer case and transmission. It's full hydro steer. We put Brannix uh, chromoly shafts in it with uh, legacy joints. Put a Dana 80 in the rear out of a dually. 44, 19.5, 16.5 boggers by 16.5 beadlocks that I built. We have a 6 liter LS in it. It's a stock motor right now, but we're building a new motor for it. Uh, full 2.5 inch stainless exhaust front to rear. Uh, turbo 400 transmission with a 203 205 doubler kit in it. Started as an S10 or a Blazer yep. chassis. Yep. And then what part of it did you cut off? The first front two and a half feet we cut out of it and just started building tube, tube from there. And then uh, we notched the frame to eliminate some of the mounts in that from the original truck. Put a flat belly pan in it so nothing will get into the drive line underneath at all. And then we did what they call a hybrid uh, exo cage on it. It's got two central hoops in, inside, and then it's got a, the exo cage that's on the roof here, trying to protect some of the body panels. And they're tied together, right? And it's all tied together. It's got four racing seats in it, so we can take passengers if we want. So uh, what's left to do on it? Still, that's not here. Just put install the winch and uh, do some shock tuning, and that's about it. Everything here you built yourself? Pretty much everything I built myself. Some help from some friends. Blue Stripe Garage out of uh, Elmville. 
<laughs> Did my gears for me. It was laying in a field on a Sunday hot afternoon <laughs> looking for a carrier. Oh yeah, I heard that too. Many times. Industrial Hydraulic did uh, all my hosing and that. Hydro steer, my uh, oil cooler lines, brake lines. Every year, um, myself and the Harrison Kinsman, we put on an event called Mental Tough Truck. Um, basically what, what we do is, um, myself and a couple of guys, we built an obstacle course at the Harrison Arena. Uh, and then we bring these things here and we beat the hell out of them and uh, see if we can do the course without destroying them. Yeah, that was a good rehearsal. I forgot to turn on the camera, so we got to do it all through. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what do you think, Cody? I mean, once he raisins it, then I'll be super pumped, but you got to appreciate it as is, like, pretty cool rig, like, really cool rig. So what'd you guys think of that? Um, pretty awesome build, huh? So now we're gonna go check out Tough Truck and uh, see it in action. Let's go! Let's go! So we made it to the event. Mike is a big part of putting on this event and um, we've been to it before. I'll have a couple links below to the other videos that we've done. Mike does a fantastic job at this event and I'm pretty confident he's gonna put on a good show. Mike's build is super cool, but there's a whole bunch of other cool stuff here too. So I think we're gonna put that stuff in the video too. So check it out. Make 
takes her through. This is our unlimited class here, so they are our biggest, meanest looking buggies out here. 